why without the stirrups. <laughs> Deep breaths, just stay relaxed. Easy. <laughs> Sit back. Sit back. Why? You're <laughs> gripping with your legs. You can hold on to the front. Hold on to your little the black strap there. Because that keeps your hands up. Oh, yep, that one. Or that one. There you go. Okay. Okay. Why does that throw me off? Like here to here. Why? I usually look at that. Look what you just did. I know. You got it? See? Oh, it's not that bad. I'm GP. Oh, no. <laughs> snuck one in. Welcome to my channel. If you've never been here before, I'm a middle aged girl living out my horsey dreams in my adult life by half leasing this gorgeous boy who really loves the cookies. His name is Taser. He is 15. He's an appendix, which means he is a thoroughbred and quarter horse cross. He's registered AQHA, I think. And um, he's teaching me how to jump, which is amazing because I suck at it. <laughs> I mean, I suck at a lot of things, but you know, that's why you have to take lessons, which is what we're doing today, taking a lesson. I'm gonna see if I can use the microphone this time so that the sound isn't quite as heinous as it was last time. It's also less windy, but it is cold. But it's November, so it should be cold. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for coming with me, and uh, we'll see what we get up to today. Hopefully no death will happen, and uh, we'll have a good day. course with no stirrups right yeah working on our no stirrup November challenge yes have you done any more on that board the well the bareback okay so yeah you did the bareback yeah and then the transitions and then jump a pole I yeah mean, tra transitions we've done a lot of transitions yeah um, I do have a bingo yes I think I, I think we've done almost most of these uh yeah we've done trap poles without stirrups yep um, you've done the transitions. Yep. Oh, did bareback. See. Anything in particular you wanted to do today on that or? I am so frustrated with my canter seat. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say anything that interests you or anything you, you want to work on canter seat. Me yeah, me, yeah. Things. Or I guess either that or like starting to count strides, which I think could go hand in hand. <laughs> well, really, you know, your canter seat, um, I mean, counting strides could help you to take your mind off and relax a That's little bit. That's what I mean. <laughs> you know, counting your strides and stuff. So we can do, how about working on the lunge? Okay. Does that sound? Let's get you warmed up first. Okay. You and him. You, I think you've walked enough. Let's, yeah. Let's go ahead and just pick up a posting trot. Yeah. 
I used to have such a nice seat and then surgery and I'm so tight right there. Like, I mean, I see a little improvement, but some days I see zero improvement. It makes me sad. <laughs> and it's, it's lower back, right? Yes. Yeah. Right exactly where I need to have looseness. Right. Is where all of my tightness is. <laughs> Let's um, do a little bit of canter. One day the word canter won't make my blood pressure spike. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go back to a trot. <laughs> Drifter. Oh, we started on the wheat grain today. That's good. And let's go ahead and change direction. When you're back on the rail, pick up the canter. And then let's sit and walk. Good oh boy. I mean, there's definitely been improvement, I think. Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> I'm just uh, very impatient with myself. <laughs> I understand, especially, you know, having an injury and having to almost like start yeah. over. Yeah. And people are actually quite nice about it. Internets. That's good. With all the advice. You just have to do this. You just have to do this. I'm like, I can't. <laughs> there's so much to do. I know. It's like, there's no secret bullet here. You have no, to wrap your really hands. I'm like, I thought I was. Yeah. <laughs> it's a lot of time, patience, yeah. practice. It's like when I was young, I just did it. I didn't have to think. I just did. And uh, I know. You get, that you, changed. Now, now you start to think and, and to worry. And, yeah. 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 I think that's the big part is the worry. <laughs> yeah, and and you know, any type of fear can also make you stiff. Yes, you're right. You, you know, so it could just be that little bit and you might not even realize it, but that little bit of like you're nervous or just not really 100% comfortable cantering and you're just going to tense up just a little bit and that's yeah. going to cause you more to bounce, right? So, yeah, but ever since the surgery, yep. Like cuz before that was like 6 months of very very bad pain. Right. So I was like protective of this yeah so you're you're probably still protected yep. especially does it bother you at all after riding or not really uh it did at first when i first started sitting the canter but then it got better because my muscles adapted and it was fine yeah right i get a little sore sometimes but that's to be expected like anytime you do anything like newish yeah. you really just this point. <laughs> all right so um let's drop our syrups <laughs> yes right <laughs> maybe yeah. i should not no we're not going over pole we're gonna start really nice and slow and easy um so you can um have, have you you've i'm sure you've ridden on the lunge right uh once at the trot with no stirrups <laughs> once yeah oh my god well, well okay so just the, the trot with no stirrups have you you've done never done any like exercises on the lunge or anything no all right cool so 
we're going to start from the beginning. How I teach every single person when I first start. Okay. Usually beginners. Yeah. If they've been riding, I kind of assume they have this education because this is like pony I club I beginning, right? I don't have an education. <laughs> I only start beginner <laughs> riders on the lunge. Yeah. All right. Because it helps to teach the seat and the hands. Yes. You know, you can't be relying on your hands. Right. For balance. Um, but right, you you were a trail guide, so that's a little bit different. Right? I was I thrown on a horse, and yeah, they were like, "Good luck!" And that's I understand how I that one too. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, formal riding education. That's why I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> um, drop your stirrups and your reins. Put the buckle in the middle. Yep. <laughs> feet out. Relax. Let your legs hang nice and long. Good. And you're gonna relax. So now your seat should move just as much as your horse's back swings, right? Yes. So deep breaths. Just relax and allow your seat to follow your horse's back. Okay. So we will kind of go through some simple, quick exercises. So we can do a little bit of the walk, a little bit of the trot. We're going to do a little bit of um, canter, not like this, but we'll do some canter on the lunge. And then I would like to get you, we'll count some strides and stuff. So okay. we're going to go pretty quickly through this. So one is going to be to draw toe circles. So with your toe, you're going to draw circles as big as you can. Okay. Like that? Nope. Just, oh, just like that. Okay. Just by flexing your ankle, right? Okay. Helps increase ankle flexibility. It's also just a stretch. So we're going to draw circles. Horse yoga. Way. All right. And then now go the other way. This is even something that you can do on the rail while you're walking around. And, and while you're doing this, just remember to breathe, relax, looking forward, really relax your seat, allow your seat to follow your horse. Right? Good. Okay. And you're going to twist. Okay, keep your head looking straight, nice and slow. None of these have to be done fast. It's more or less just to stretch. So like, this one, you know, I like this one, I can feel my back muscles stretching, yes. right? Horse yoga. <laughs> yeah, okay. And then the next one we're gonna do are gonna be arm circles forward. So we're gonna take one and then the other. So one arm forward and then the other arm forward. Okay, helps to kind of loosen up the shoulders a little bit. Okay, and now we're gonna do them backwards. Good. This one's good if you tend to lean forward, have hunched shoulders. Sometimes you can skip the forward one and just do the backwards one just to help to kind of get. Sit. But the yeah. forward one also, you know, just helps again, loosen up and stretch a little bit. Okay. Good. Next, we're gonna do toe touches. So with one hand, you're gonna grab the back of your saddle and then the other hand, you're gonna reach to your opposite toe. Yep. Reach down, reach down, reach down. Ooh, 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 ooh. Stretch. <laughs> there you go. Good. He's like, He's what? like you're on balance. He's like, woman. You're Why? Out there, buddy. Go ahead. <laughs> He's like, are you okay? Do you need help? <laughs> and so basically, good. you can just reach as far as you're comfortable and just kind of, we're looking for that stretch in your lower back. <sighs> Aw. He's so nice. <laughs> He's like, are you all right? I takes care of you. Good boy. Oh, you're so good. Good. Okay. So those are just the simple ones I usually start everybody with. There's tons more, but we're going to just do those <laughs> for now. We are going to start with a sitting trot. Okay. So when you're ready, you can ask him to pick up a trot. I don't know why. Without the stairs. Like... Deep breath. Just stay relaxed. Easy. <laughs> sit back. Sit back. Why is you're this... gripping with your legs. <laughs> You can hold on to the front. Hold on to your little the black strap there. Because that keeps your hands up. Oh, yep, yeah, that one. Or that one. There you go. Okay, okay, okay. Sorry. Shoulders back. I just, just a panicked bit. a little. Okay. Good. Okay. Don't forget to breathe. Right? I'm fine. Now he's going nice and slow, so it whenever you're comfortable, you can let go with the other hand. Put your hands on your hips. Hmm. You want to lean back a little bit more, kind of tuck your tailbone. And you see, he even slows down if you put, drop your weight back a little bit. Good. Good. Deep breath. Just breathe. Just My breathe. brain is like not letting me let okay. go. So let's just keep going until you're comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> you got it. Whichever way is most comfortable for you. Just like you will not let go of that right hand. 
Let's hold the back of your saddle with your left hand. Yep. And the front of your saddle with your right hand. Now, sit back. Bring yourself back. Yep. Good. Why is this so scary? <laughs> You're good. You got it. Now, switch hands. And back again with your shoulders. Just sit back a little bit. There you go. up, shoulders back, and breathe. Good boy. Good. Man. It's okay. We'll get there. You've got it. It's all in your head. I know. You just have to that says it. Breathe and relax. I just, I think it's trust issues. It's not, <laughs> it's not you. <laughs> I think I just don't, don't trust myself. If I can do it like this, I should be able to do it like uh -huh. this. Not much different. Yep. Oh my God. My own brain holds me back. It's okay. It's a little, it's a, you know, a little out of time. We'll just kind of, we'll build up to it. Okay. And that's why I just had you like, you know, think about you just took your hands off and swapped your hands right. back and forth, right? Yes. And, and you were fine. Yeah, I know. Right? Wow. That's okay. Let me just start with my right hand. <laughs> okay. And this one's not on anything. Okay. Whatever you're comfortable with to start, yeah. we'll just get you to get, going. So I'm nice, not like, at yep. first. And a nice steady pace. Let's, let's get his pace. <sighs> okay. Get you just breathing, relaxed. Okay. And then we'll work on moving around a little bit. Okay. okay. Good. You have a nice pace to start with. Deep breath. Good. Shoulders back just a little. You want to think about sitting on your pockets, right? Sitting back a little bit, sitting on your pockets. Keep your heels down. Again, shoulders back just a little. Good. breathing. I can tell you look like you're holding your breath. There you go. Good. Shoulders back just a little. Back. <laughs> you're right. Why? Why does that throw me off? Like here to here. Why? I used to, look at that. Look what you just did. I know. Hey, you got it. See? Oh, it's not that bad. Oh. Put your arms out to your sides. Sit back. Deep breath. Shoulders back. Arm circles. Backwards, not forward. Yep. You got it. It's never his fault, literally ever, <laughs> ever, ever. Okay. All right. All right. Let's let's go one more time. Okay. And then we'll pick our surfs back up and we'll go to camp. Okay. <gasps> Thank you for doing this for me. I feel like all of these holes that are being filled in is really going to help me a lot. And th this, you know, it, it'll also help you just relax and just build some confidence. Yeah. Right? I, you can do these things. You are capable of doing yes. it. Yes. Right? It is all in your head right now. I'm just, yeah. Yeah, right? you're right. And it's right. making you tense. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you really just got to right, remember, right. take a deep breath, sit back a little bit. Trust, 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 trust. Right? He's not going to sit on your pockets. Bad. Because when you lean forward, you're going to lighten your seat and you're gripping. Yes. And telling him to and go he fast. goes fast. Yes. Oh, man. We want to keep him slow, so you want to sit back. Think about like when you're trail riding Western, yeah. going down the hill. Right. You know, you're going to exactly. sit back in that, that cowboy seat. Yes. Do that. Somehow along the way, I lost that. <laughs> Just be nice and relaxed. We're riding down the trail. Well, Whatever. I usually, to be fair, I usually rode down the trail with stirrups. <laughs> Keeping your heels down, toes up, just to keep that lower leg off him so you're not squeezing. A light hold, like a maintaining leg is fine, just mm -hmm. to keep him going. Mm -hmm. Be careful not to grip and tell him to go faster, right? Mm -hmm. Make sure you're breathing. Put your arms out to your sides. And then when you're ready, arm circles backwards. One arm and then the other. There you go, good. One, then the other, one, then the other. Good, nice big circles. Just kind of focusing on stretching, relaxing, breathing. Sitting back just a little bit. And
and this is my wheat grain. Yeah, you're doing great. Okay, hands back on your hips. So the next thing we're gonna do is our toe touches, but we're not gonna reach to our toes. We're gonna grab the back of our saddle with one hand, drop. Okay, and then we're going to reach basically just to our knee or below our knee. Okay, keeping your seat, yep, and stretching. Point your toe up, yep, just touch your knee, and then switch. Just touch your knee, and then switch. Oh, you're such a good boy. What a good boy. He's like, you're doing good now. We keep growing. Thank <laughs> All right. you. Great job. Thank you. Okay. okay. So we are going to go back into canter work because we did a lot of trot work on the lunge line. Um, Thank you. So, you know, maybe we'll just visit the lunge line every so often. Yeah. For no. all levels of riders. That felt really um, good to see. I feel like I broke through my head a little bit. Yeah. Well, that that too. You know, we just kind of keep, keep building on it. Keep, we'll repeat the same exercises. Yes. You know, until everything becomes easy and comfortable. Yeah. You know, and then we just build on those. I want you to count coming out of the corner up to your first pole and then counting in between the two poles. Let's go ahead and pick up a canter and let's see how you do. Just try and stay as straight as possible, mm -hmm. right? Aiming for those center stripes on each pole um, and canter straight afterwards and then break to a trot before the corner. Got it? Yes. And right now, as you, as you ask him to canter, you're kind of pushing your hands forward and leaning forward. Good, eyes up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two. Woo. Good. That was good. So just making it a habit of counting out loud, you'll just get more comfortable with it and you'll also start to recognize how much ground you're covering. Yes. Right? So in between those two poles, how many strides did you get? Two. Correct. That is a two stride. Well, yes. You did. He went a I little mean, bit. I mean, we took it long. Right. But that's because you were not in the middle. He went to the right. But I also said his stride is a little bit shorter than the average horse. Yep. Yep. I set that for your average horse stride. Yes. Okay. So okay, that is a two stride. Pick it up a little stay bit. Stay in the middle. He still might take it a little long. But if we stay in a lighter seat and just give a little bit. Okay. Okay. It'll be, you won't have to worry if he takes it long that you're going to be left behind. <laughs> Shorten up just a little bit. Kind of, yep. Get him to pay attention. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Whoop! <laughs> I counted wrong. It was two. Yep, that's okay. You were you were correct in counting up to eight, but then you counted the stride. I counted the, the landing. Yeah, you counted. Yes, you counted the landing or the stride over the pole. So <sighs> that's okay. You know what we'll do is I'm gonna have you count up to the pole. You're gonna say jump, and then you're going to count again. Oh, okay. All right. Got it. Yeah. That'll help you kind of yeah, that's good. bridge the gap there. There you go. Good. Looking ahead with your eyes. Good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Jump. One, two. Okay. Good. Again, you can see how that's a little bit long for yes. him, right? He's coming, he, yeah. he, he's getting the two strides, but he's like, I gotta He stretch. has to fling himself at the yeah. third, because I'm not So him for him, we would have to get push him a little bit more to get that stride okay. if you were jumping, yes. right? To not yes. knock down any poles right. and also to get the correct distances. This is it's okay. good though, because it's really making me think. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, eyes up. Keep your heels down, your shoulders back. One, two, three, four, five, six. Jump. One, two. Sorry, Betty. <laughs> Push harder. Good. Oop. Okay. Well, thank you. Sorry. It's okay. <laughs> This is going to be a lot of strides. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
One, two, three. <laughs> that was better, but I didn't say jump. And I didn't trot before the pole. That was good though. I pushed him a little bit. Yeah. And you see, he got the distance a lot better that time. Yes. Okay. Let's do that one more time. Once again on the right rein. I don't know what's wrong. Ooh. Ooh. Eyes up. You have to turn a little sooner. Oh. Good. And then when he relaxes, let's sit and walk. Good boy. Good boy. Good. All right. I think that's good for today. Yeah. That was nice. You can walk him out till he's cool. Yeah. Thank you. This way. You're the best. You're the best. Oh, I hope that that worked. It did! Friend, look, there's two of you! Goose bread. Oh my god, how many are there? Oh, that's it. Bye. Don't hate you, but